Welcome. And welcome to Yorkshire. North Yorkshire. And the weather's beautiful. Gorgeous. Hey. Just what I wanted. Now, I'm heading along a track. Started from that car park there, where you can see my lovely silver van. That bridge, Surrender Bridge. So I'm starting from Surrender Bridge and I'm travelling along just up the road. Turned left and I'm on this track. Heading towards Old Gang Smelt Mine. Uh, never been here before. So I've no idea what to expect really. Just thought, yeah, that looks a nice place to go and wild camp. So hopefully I'll pitch the tent out of the way. So I know all farmers use this track here. So I'll try and pitch the tent out of the way. And uh, I'm hoping to get a really good uh, pictures from sunset and stuff. So picked a cracking day. It's very little wind. That's good as well. So yeah, all's good at the moment. When the sun buggers off though, it's quite cool. But that's probably why you I'm wondering if you are I'm wondering why I've still got my coat on then. But yeah, still a bit nippy when the sun goes down, so the sun's coming in and out, in and out. So what I'll do, let me walk up this track, find where I'm going, get tent up if I can. Catch up with you in a bit. See you later. That in the distance, right in the middle of the screen, I don't know where I can see it, I can't see it because I've got my shades on. That's where I'm going to. So I've only got about three, four hundred yards to go. There's plenty of grouse out. There's grouse shooting butts just along there. So, hmm, looking good already. Well, people, I have arrived. And what marvels there is here. Ooh. Got loads of here. Yeah, and there's still some more buildings up there. Down here. Buildings up there. Gotta be here all day. <laughs> if I wasn't so wet, I'd have got my tent in there, oh, nice and flat. Never mind, never mind. Oh, this is like gunner side, but better. Not lock, anybody in? Oh, I see the problem, yeah, you've got a leaky roof.
so whether there used to be steps or whether it used to be a wall of some sort. some pictures later. You know the golden hour just as the sun drops I'm hoping to get some really composition and stuff like that. But uh, I think it's gonna go down on there. But we'll see, we'll see eh? the bridge to nowhere Not fear, I am down. <laughs> Hoping to either pitch on here or there. Where my bag is. Unless I find a different, a different one. So I'll leave it there for now. Let's go do. No, I'll grab it just in case. Let me catch up with you in a minute. Yeah, look, you can see it. I'm on the other side now of the river. You can see it in all its glory now. And what I've just been looking at. And then two buildings down there have all been shorted up, so I'm guessing they're storage sheds. And then you've got some workings up on top here, look, as well. So, hmm. Pretty good. I'm just going to this one up here. Yeah. Not yet put my tent up. Not sure where I'm going to put it yet. Still loads of people out. Right, tent's up. Near this little building here. I'm on the other side. So there's the uh, the mine workings. I've just I've just gone out the way because there's quite a few people still out. But I thought if I go out the way, I'm, uh, I'll be all right. Bit of a struggle getting all the pegs in mind. Look. Never mind. New 
temp by the way. And for the MSR. Quite pleased with it. It's no four season mine, but uh, it's okay for what it is and how much I paid. It's a reasonable size for a two man. Well, it's not never going to be me in it, mine. It's got two porches, um, two doors, everything you'd need. Apart from four season. I didn't really want another four season, I'd already got one. So, yeah, that's it. It's the MSR Elixir 2, Mark 2. It's okay. Um, that's how far I am away. There's all the workings look. And as you can see, there's still people. I'll just come out of the way. Weather's still that grand. Picked a glorious day. I'm going to have a bite to eat now, get the mat up, um, and then set the camera up ready for trying to pick some nice shots. So, what I might do. Just put everything in the tent, have a bite to eat, go down and take some pictures with a proper camera rather than the GoPro. And uh, see what I get. So, catch up with you in a bit. This is what view I've got from one of the sides. The car's parked right just other, where the runner is, you can see, just other side there. The tent's pitched there. All the ruins are there, some are there. These buildings here are all locked up, like storage sheds. There's another one just around the corner. And hey. Just in front of where I've parked, it's Surrender Bridge. Just in front of that, there's Surrender Midge. I think that's a, a smelting mill as well. So I shall hopefully get some pictures of them in the morning as well. What what an amazing view. Oh, Yorkshire it is finest. There is behind me, behind that building where you are showing you where the uh, the rabbits are, there is a um, an edge behind it. That looks intriguing as well. So I shall Google that, find out what edge it is, and try and do a wild camp on top of that. But gunner side is that way. There is a square, a, a walkway, it's like a square type of thing. Gunner side's up in that area, up that way. I believe, anyway. So, hmm. Having a, a lovely day. Catch you later. <laughs>Welcome back. I'm in my tent now. It's dropped really cold. Fog's come in as well. Um, you can't see anything anymore. The um, my light composition and all that lot were absolutely bloody rubbish. All the sun did is went behind the, uh, the, the sides of the hill. So well, that were a waste of time. So, yeah, well, never mind. Didn't get a uh, time lapse of this 
sun setting out like that, that were rubbish. I'm in kind of in the wrong position to be quite honest, because I'm in a gully. But never mind, never mind. Can't win them all, can you? So yeah, I've just been fed and watered, I'm chilling out now. Um, just wonder what to do now. Might just get up, I'm nearly night I think, and see you in the morning. So yeah. And now it's dropping, it is dropping cold now, really, really, really cold, but uh, it seems to be alright inside the tent. Right, so what I'm going to do, catch up with you in the morning, ciao for now. Good morning, and welcome to a foggy Yorkshire, let me show you. Fog, 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 oh it's cleared up a bit Matt. It wasn't a minute ago. But yeah, fog. Had a lovely, nice, quiet night. It rained a bit. It was only a bit though. Didn't have a lot of rain, uh, wind. Didn't really test the tent out, but never mind. But yeah, all in all, quite a good wild camp really. Lovely scenery. Lots of ruins. Um, a nice place to pitch, as such, out of the way. Yeah. So, yeah. I'm just having a cup of tea now and a bit of breakfast, and then I'm going to pack down and go on. I'm going to Newcastle now, see me brother. So, thanks for watching my videos. Keep on wild camping, and I'll catch up on my next one. Ciao now. Bye bye. Hi, folks. I'm back at the car now. There's the car. I'm literally across the road from the car, hang on, across the road from the car is this, and this is Surrender Bridge Smelting Mill. Um, I just thought I'd, I'd show you this one as well. Oh, right, that's what that is up there. That's that, what that building is right up the top, the last building I was looking at it. Uh, oh, gang, it must be a peat store. Such a waste, such a waste of building. Well, I'd show you that. Interesting, isn't it? Well, I'm going now. <laughs> so, adios. Bye bye. <laughs>